Hi class, my name is Mohammed Prince and this is my week three discussion post. So the overview, I'm going to go over the code of, eth code of ethics, uh, ethical guidance, and as well as a closing slide. So the code of ethics, I chose a public defender. Um, so the code of ethics for a public defender is um, to uphold the integrity and independence of the office. And the impropriety is that um, they should always avoid impropriety and the appearance of impropriety. Standards are that um, they should adhere to the appropriate standards in performing the duties of the office improvements is that um, they should always strive for improvements and engage in activities to improve the law the legal system and the administration of justice uh, regulations is that they should regulate um, their extra official activities to minimize the risk of conflict with their official duties and um, they should also uh, regularly file reports of compensation that they received for all extra official activities. And um, inappropriate activity is to refrain from inappropriate political activity and things that can be viewed as a conflict of interest. So ethical guidance minus for Christianity. So, um, uh, so Christian ethics. Christians acknowledge not only a duty to announce their the gospel, um, profess their faith, and worship God, but also to live their entire lives according to God's will. Um, the next is the Ten Commandments. Um, the Ten Commandments are that God is the only God, and we shouldn't place anything before God, um, and that we only serve God. Um, the second one is that you shall not take the name of the Lord um, in vain. The third is to remember to keep um, the Sabbath day a uh, holy day. The fourth is to honor your mother and father. The fifth, um, you shall not kill. The sixth is you, sh you shouldn't com shall not commit adultery. The seventh is, you know, you shall not steal. Um, the eighth is... Uh, not bear false witness against your neighbor. The ninth, um, shall not um, covet your neighbor's wife. And the tenth is that um, you shall not covet your neighbor's goods. So um, a theory that I chose for this um, is virtue theory. Um, I, I thought it goes good here when talking about ethical guidance and um, the code of ethics. So... Um, uh, ethical frameworks, um, I would say that they do agree with each other because they're both talking about uh, integrity and not stealing and just uh, holding yourself to a high moral standard. So um, I would say that the ethical frameworks do agree with each other. Um, when we live by the Ten Commandments, we're following the Word of God and the way Jesus lived in his life. So that's the, the point is that Jesus is an example and our ethical guide as Christians that we can live our lives without sin. So in closing, I just want to say thank you for viewing my video and uh, look forward to interact with, interacting with you guys in the comment section. Thank you.